It may have been a disastrous start to the Ashes campaign for England's cricketers, but at grassroots level, One Kent Primary has a lot to celebrate. By Singwood School in Faversham has just won a national award for the way it delivers cricket coaching to its pupils. The school has worked with the charity Chance to Shine and Kent Cricket to introduce its children to the sport for the first time. Here's our sports reporter, Juliet Parkin. Nice. Winning awards doesn't mean you don't get to have fun. These year five and six pupils are being taught how to play cricket in school and some of them have even done leadership training so they can teach younger ones the game. They had to put the bat, put the bat behind the blue cone and they can't use it no more. I wanted to be a leader as, as well because I like... I like teaching other people new skills and abilities to be able to do new sports. Bisingwood has just been named Primary School of the Year at the Chance to Shine Awards and were presented with the trophy at Lord's Cricket Ground by Sussex captain and Southern Vipers cricketer Georgia Adams. To be honest, I was really surprised because we're quite a small school and no one would really expect us to win. Around half the pupils here are on free school meals and very few have ever tried cricket outside school, so they couldn't believe they'd come out on top. It was absolutely fantastic um, in the context, like all the schools in the country, difficult times coming up to Christmas, um, everything around Covid, and then to get something so amazing to really give us that lift was awesome. Nationally, the sport is in crisis, addressing deep-rooted issues over racism and lack of diversity. But at grassroots, charities like Chance to Shine are trying to take the sport to all communities. Kent Cricket works with the charity to provide free coaching. For me, I think it's all about trying to bed those life skills as well into the sessions. We don't give up, do we? We always try our best. Cricket is obviously the main sort of element of it, but it's there to develop our leadership, our resilience, our teamwork. Um, Respect, you know, these are important skills that obviously are good in the classroom, out of school. The school's now delivering the coaching sessions themselves and hopes that these pupils will carry on playing. And some will certainly be the coaches of the future. Juliet Parkin, BBC Southeast Today, Faversham. Great stuff.